and welcome to another Compose tutorial. I'm Ross, and today I'm going to be showing you how to create a custom wallpaper for your iPod Touch without jailbreaking. Uh, this is a process of syncing photos using iTunes, not using a program that you have installed already, or a jailbreaking program that you installed in your iPod. This is totally uh, without jailbreaking. So let's get started. You'll need to open up your program such as GIMP or Photoshop. And I am not going to go through in this tutorial on how to make one, other than that all you have to do is open or create a new file of uh, one that has a 320 by 480 resolution. I have this one uh, that I am going to be using. So all you have to do is click File, Save As, and then go on your desktop and you'll need a, uh, you can actually just save it onto your desktop by uh, changing the XCF to JPG for JPEG, pressing enter, exporting it, and uh, make the quality 100, just because it looks a lot better on the iPod when you have it at 100. So click save. Then you can close out a GIMP, you don't need it anymore. And notice that it's on your, uh, on your desktop as a JPEG form. So now you'll have to create here I'll just delete the folder I already made and click file new folder and uh, name this folder whatever you want I'm back ground uh, and then just drag and drop into that folder that picture that you just made so now that that's in there you'll need to open up iTunes if you haven't installed it, you'll need it to do this. And just go in. Uh, it's backing up my iPod right now. So all you have to do is click on your iPod icon down here. Mine is Ross's iPod. And click Photos. You will need to then check this Sync Photos From button and sync them from not my pictures click that little my pictures button and click choose folder then go into your desktop and click that folder that you just created and click select folder that's all you need to do and then click apply so now it's just syncing up the iPod and uh, next I will be showing you what it looks like actually on my iPod touch so just wait and see now I will be showing you how to say, set the wallpaper that we've just used as the wallpaper for the stand for the lock screen and the default wallpaper. I just have a normal wallpaper of the I Apple icon. So now you'll need to click photos on your uh, screen and then go into albums, photo album. Now you will see a little icon of the picture you have made. Uh, then you'll need to go down on the bottom left corner. There is a small button that you'll press so that you can see that right there and then click that and it should give you four options and a cancel button. Click use as wallpaper. Then you'll need to click set and depending on what you want you can either set it just as lock screen the normal wallpaper or both I set it for both just because I like this wallpaper and if you scroll to the side where you don't have any apps you can see the wallpaper you can also see it through the apps but you can see it better once that uh, you're on the side notice that since I set it to both it set onto my lock screen Thanks for watching. Please visit my blog at compwiztutorials.blogspot.com. There is a link to the in the description. Thanks for watching.